What's up guys, Sean the Bro here, and today we are back for some more Elden Ring. So, in the last episode we beat Commander Neol, I believe is how it's pronounced. And we were able to explore and do a few other optional bosses and areas. I believe we completed Einswell, I think the name is, or, or maybe it was uh, just Eisel, something like that. The little underground river area. And we did a few other things for... Uh, not Ronnie, right? Hey, Super Crim. Nice to see you. Thanks for coming in. Uh, um, then we got to this town here, which is called Ordina. I forgot what the name was. But we did this uh, little quest first here that we weren't able to complete last time because we ran a little over. But what we have to do is go around and light all these braziers. So we're going to actually do that today. Uh, if we can. Sad I couldn't join last time. That's okay. All is good. I'm glad you're here now. I appreciate you being here. Okay. So yes, we have to light the four. You ready? I skimmed through to get to Cliff Notes. Okay. Uh, the Cliff Notes version of the stream is struggled a bunch with Commander Neol beat him eventually then failed this like three times but i eventually learned that uh we did do a lot yeah i felt pretty good about the last episode i eventually learned how to do this one i know where all of the little temples little braziers are to light but uh there's like these invisible stalker assassin things that want to kill you and last time on my final attempt i had actually gotten this first one here I jumped across the roof, and I ended up getting killed by this magical bow and arrow user. You have a sentry's torch. I don't believe I do, actually. Yeah, it reveals the invisible guy. See, that That makes a lot of sense, actually. That would be really useful. Oh, wait. Do I not have to relight it if I already lit it once? Oh. Well, that changes things quite a bit then, doesn't it? Now, last time I died here because, yes, this guy. Now, I think I can actually get to the next. They're actually all girls. Okay. That is good to know. I did not. Can I even, like, make that jump? Yes, I can. Okay. Wow. Solid. No! Did I... Can I get there? No, I, I missed out. I need to be there. Dang it. Who are you and why are you bothering me, sir? Or madam. Mademoiselle. I will have to end your life now. So I can complete this effort, gal. Get yeeted, right? That was not awesome. I really like that. But yeah. So I'm glad, you know what, we did quite a bit in the last episode. I'm pretty proud of that. I felt pretty good. And this this episode, I'm hoping we can do just as much. I'm a little, uh, you know, a little in my PJs today. I did work today, but I got changed after work. And I'm all comfortable now. So I might, like, look a little uh, less presentable than usual. My apologies. <laughs> but I'm just chilling. Figured we could have a fun Elden Ring stream. So, I know that there's a guy, or, excuse me, there is a lady over here who was attacking me. Oh, no, 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 it wasn't all the way up there, right? Ugh. This might kill me while I'm going up the ladder. Woo! Let's grab that real quick. The slumbering egg. Is this, uh, I, I feel like I'm missing it, right? I need to go over there. I need to go across. This would be my third one, then. Uh, wait a second. Can I not actually get up from here? These guys tear me up. I don't want to get killed here, but I gotta jump off. I did not mean to jump the whole way off. Uh, hello there! Oh, it's actually pronounced Everjail. Is the old way to spell jail. Oh, I did not know that. Thank you. That is really... Very, really... That was really helpful. Thank you. 
You guys did say that they were prisons. You told me that, but I did not realize it actually genuinely translated to that. So ever jail. Okay, that is interesting. I never would have would have guessed that, but. Thank you for the tip. That is really nice. Hey, David, thanks for coming in, by the way. And these are all facts. These are, in fact, all jails holding prisoners. Okay. That is starting to make more sense then. Thank you very much for enlightening me. You know what? I appreciate that. So I think we only need one more. Assuming that last one's lit, which I believe it is. I'm pretty sure I see it right now. We should just need this one up here. Right? That one... How do I get up there? Because I can't actually... Can I jump up here somehow? I can. Okay. I know, I know. There we go. That was a powerful one. It, you know, it was an impressive jump. I, I thought it might be a little too high. But not for our attractive, fat bodysuit, jarhead-wearing hero. There we go. So a seal was broken in town. So we lit all four of them. And we've completed the Everjail. New Twitch cut, by the way. Excited about that. <laughs> Wasn't trying to do that, but just uh, saw it as I was drinking it. I was like, hey, that's pretty cool. So we... we broke the seal so all of those green things it looks like they're gone because there was um a blockage up there and i couldn't walk through certain parts of the town just depending on the direction i came so i'm I... yeah i'm assuming they're all fixed up and i might be able to actually go in there and see some additional things too i wonder if i talk to them if it's any different okay i can't even speak then I like the get on the ground crit attack. Yeah, that one is really nice. That, it looked really good. That's actually like the first time I've done that or the first time that I've really realized what was going on, I guess. But I liked it a lot. Oh, here, let me do this real quick. There we go. I want to make sure we don't drop frames. Um, so I I lowered, I figured out that, um, I, we did fix the frame dropping issue I was having, but I also figured out some performance things I can do while I'm actually streaming that make it way better. I like that it tried to, it, it tried to <laughs> block that term. Uh, only has the certain enemies like those archers and those laughing midgets. Who are the laughing midgets? I don't have I seen them. Oh wait a second, I know exactly who you're talking about. Actually, those creepy little. I think of them as like little creepy goblins. Okay, cool. Yeah, that's a really good animation. I like it a lot. Invigorating cured me. Okay, wow. Cool. So. We're gonna take this now. We did not have access to this before. And vulgar militia, right? Is that is that what they're called? Is that really their name? I mean, it fits for them. What is that? The official name? This is a cool sight of grace too. Hi, I'm a little busy at the moment. Don't do that, please. Here we go, okay. Here we go is usually a bad thing. Usually not a good string of characters. I'm really sorry that that happened to you. Bubble Zone. Part two. Sacramental Bud, okay. Strip of white flesh. Man. Ooh, bubble zone. Big bubble blower.
Oof. I don't like that. Am I supposed to make that jump? Alright, screw it. Woo! Flawless. Stone sword key. Bubble zone. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Right? Um, oh, those are the flowers. I don't know if I want to mess with that right now. Dang it. I did not think they were doing that much then. Oh, oh, it's three in a row. That's why. I didn't even realize there were three back to back. All right. Let's do it this time. We're going to get it first try. Well, first try meaning first try after the first try. First try doesn't count as the first try because it's like that was the practice run. This is the real first try, and we're going to get it. What item is debuffing your health? Um, I don't know. I could not tell you what item was debuffing my health, to be honest with you. I wish I could be of more... Oh, my gosh. I wish I could be of more assistance. Dude, that is a long... I mean, I hope he died before that because he's got a long way down. Oh, the hug, right? Right, the hug. The hug would would do that. Good. Nope, not good. Uh, look into your inventory. Okay, I can take a look. If it is the hug, David prob... I think David's right, because we did hug... The one that always gives us a debuff. I can take a quick look and see. Uh, wait, in my inventory? Or in my, like, equipment? Oh, do you have Baljin's Blessing? Uh, well, of course I do. Everyone who's anybody has that. I do. I do, in fact, have that. Um, okay. Well, I don't actually have any runes here. Woo! Hello, sir. Sir! Why have you done this to me? Oh, those are debuffs? Like, I... Wait, if I... If you hold them, they're debuffs? Like, because they're in my inventory, they're debuffing? Oh, holding that in your inventory is causing the debuff? Oh, I had no idea. I've been playing the game for God knows how long, though, with that. <laughs> I hugged her at the beginning of the game, too. So I, there's a very good chance I had this debuff since the start of time. My beloved, okay. Woo! That's interesting, yeah. That is something else. giant antmen <laughs> I love seeing them like they're huge right and that's good enough are they getting along with these guys you guys don't care okay they don't care that they, they're not fighting just use it to get rid of the debuff okay does it benefit me at all to have it like is there any reason I would keep it because I haven't used it this whole time and so I'm kind of wondering if I should just... Now, now it's almost like we got to keep it. It's come with us this far. I know there's a lot of space over here, but I don't really see a lot of stuff over in this direction that I need to pick up. Uh, there's a little something there, actually. Can you just back off me? Sir? Or madam. So I do want to grab that, as risky as it is, but I guess why I don't have any runes right now. Woo! I'm going for it. Woo! OK. 
Okay, cool. Anything else while I'm over here? Yep, over here. Don't fall off. That's cool. Anything else? Alright, I think we're good. I think we're genuinely ready to proceed down the tree. The Hatling tree. Okay, cool. Well, thank you for telling me that. For real, I did not know. So... So what is it? That thing all the way to the, the right? The symbol all the way on the right? Under my stamina bar? Is that what was showing that was a health debug? Debug. Pro strat, if you hold back, you cancel the item pick up anything. Really? That is a pro strat. That's literally like a pro strat. Newman's room. Classic Scarlet Rot. Woo! Is it down there? Yeah, it's all the way down there. Okay, so that's something we have to unlock. Well, let's just get this right here. Easy money. Thank you. That is a good pro strat. Hey, Grandma. Thanks for coming in. Uh, so we need 47,000, basically, for our next level up. Got ya. Yeah, I was going to say, you can definitely still move in this one. But uh, you're, you're right. You're absolutely right. Like, So you're saying if I do... I'll have to try it again without because honestly I haven't. I um I haven't paid enough attention to it. But I believe you and I think it is probably a pro strat. So I'm gonna try and do it. I'm definitely if, if I'm nothing else, I'm a professional. It all the Soulsborne games, clearly. One of the best. I like how he watched me swing the halberd twice in front of him. And he's like, yeah, I don't think this guy's trying to be malicious toward me. Woo! I was supposed to land on that. Oh, You guys want the sun or something? Goodbye. <laughs> okay. smithing stone always good hefty beast bone <clears throat> see the difference when running be running and blocking at the same time keep keep both buttons pressed when picking up oh running and blocking Oh, if you hold block. I thought you, I thought you said back. I'm sorry. I s I might have said it correctly. I don't know, but I definitely thought it incorrectly. Hi, friend. Oh, Agent Dragon Smithing Stone. That's what I actually need to upgrade my weapon right now, my halberd. I'm so happy about that. Yo, hold up. I'm just collecting the items. I'm not here to fight you. Just stealing from your ancient temple here. Yep. No, I got you. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try it on this one right here. Okay. So if I was running when I picked it up. No, no, you're good. You're good. I actually, I do know what you mean. I just uh, misunderstood it first. I read the wrong thing in my head. So let me read this again. If you hold block, you cancel and pick up the animation, allowing you to move fast and pick stuff up. So you're saying if I run? Oh, that is actually way better. Thank you. Nice tip, especially since I go in and I grab everything. Okay, cool. It's pretty awesome right there. Woo! <laughs> cool, 
I'm really excited to be able to upgrade the halberd again. We upgraded it so many times the last few episodes. Do not knock me off, time, sir. Hold up and towards us. Really? It cancels the uh, the item pickup animation. It is interesting. Jumper. Okay. So uh, there's a bunch of different paths we can take here. Let's go up here real quick first. I don't know if this is just getting us back where we were or if this is a slightly separate higher platform. No, this is just the... Well, this is the other building, sure, but... Uh, it doesn't actually do anything for us that I can see. So I'm going to jump back in here instead. Uh, okay. Cool. Break all your stuff, sorry. Not really, because I did it on purpose, but still. Woo! That's not good. <laughs> did not realize I was going to be... Well, there's the, there's the exclamation mark gravity death right there. Tell you that. Okay. Well, forget that. That is not what we wanted. But what we did want is to jump here. Okay. I'm gonna run by you. Yep, I, I I deserve that. I think you missed the chest there too. See, it felt like there was something back there. You might be right. I'll, I'll check again because. I do feel like there was some, like, it kind of feels like that room would be pointless otherwise. So maybe I did. Uh... Well, you finally made it to the Howling Tree. Three weeks after I initially suggested it. The Howling Tree. Well, you know what? It Actually, we made a lot of progress due to that because we started off, yeah, Howling Tree. And then it turned into, oh, let's do these other quest lines. And it's been a lot of fun. So really, it's been, it's been really good. I'm glad we did it. Glad we were going this direction. Yeah, sorry, I didn't even realize this was an actual chest. I saw it. I really did, but I did not realize it was one we could open. I was thinking it was one of those silly ones that you can just destroy by rolling into. It's like, who wants that? Woo! Cool. Well... Maybe one day we will keep our feet on the ground. Ooh. Cool. Next area, let's go over here. Let's try going inside. I think this. No, it doesn't actually. Hi. Fairy does only play once a week. Yeah, I mean, you know what? I need to play 30 times a week to 100% this game, I'll tell you. It feels so big. Like, I know it is big, but it, it feels like we keep making progress. I'm like, yeah, that's awesome. And then I see all the other side stuff that I could do, and I'm like, man, there is a lot of good stuff there that we haven't done yet that we're I feel like I'm missing out on I could probably jump there but I can also just walk across the bridge I 
Oh, yeah, you know what? I heard that, actually. I think it was maybe David said that, or, or, or someone else said that, too. So, New Game Plus doesn't seem as special in this game, according to pretty much everyone that I've heard so far talk about it. I didn't really mean to send this guy off on his own, believe it or not. I was trying to not go in there yet, because I wanted to explore a little bit more. But now seeing all these ghouls around me, I'm like, hmm. Okay, he totally would have been crushed by that just there. See you later, fools. Yeah, that's fair. That that is what you said last time. You're right, actually. It wasn't about the, the items, but you're but I did hear that twice now, so you guys uh so unfortunately it doesn't seem like the new game plus is as special in this game for potentially several reasons. Um I do know that there are different endings. I haven't had them spoiled or anything, but I do know there are different endings. I heard someone say you have to play through multiple times or use cloud saves. To get the achievements, which is fine. The other Souls games are like that, too. No new items and stuff to find. It's quite literally the same game again. Ah, uh, got ya. I, I do understand. You know what? I totally get what you mean, though. Not only is it... Is it the same game, but it's the same game. Nothing additional is changing and making you more excited to go around and find stuff. That makes sense. I, uh, I can definitely respect that. I usually do a really big first run, just grab whatever, have fun with it, and then I will do the completionist run, so I'll go through and get the different endings and stuff, but other than that, I won't, I probably won't explore farther than I had to for pretty much anything, so as long as I do everything once, I won't need to do it again, so I would skip as much as I could, but it was still, Loretta, okay, Night of the Hallowed Tree. I thought we beat Loretta already. Didn't we have someone named Loretta? Yeah, it was the ghost, right? Wasn't there a ghost Loretta? Yeah, by the pond. Or, or not the pond, excuse me. By the the uh, the little fountain. I'm pretty sure we did. Like, that was like a, a spirit or like a ghost. But this is like not that. This is the real thing. Uh, remember, ghost horse... Yeah, you fought Ghost Loretta. Okay, yeah, I absolutely do remember that. 100% I do. I thought it sounded familiar, but I didn't know if I was just crazy. I thought maybe I was out of my mind. Stronger Loretta. Okay. Cool. Um... I'm gonna send this up like usual. That way I don't have to do that every time. Uh, checking if it's only me getting lag on the stream. So I obviously can't tell. I will say that I haven't dropped a single frame yet through OBS, so I don't believe it is the stream. But it is possible that something else is going wrong. Uh, I've had it where Twitch actually was having issues, which caused lag. So even, which caused lag, excuse me. And so uh, that might be the case too. Come on, Mimic, help me out with Loretta here.
You can't fall on me like that. I need you, brother. That is one heck of an arrow. Good combo. Good combo. I wish my Mimic could combo like that, but you know what? Only Loretta can. I forget, did you already do the Caves and Concentrated Snowfield? There's only three. I don't know if I've done them all or not. There's a good chance I've run into at least one of them and finished it, but I don't know. I did not do every cave for sure that I went across. I definitely have to go back and do those or do them on subsequent runs. Uh, I'm not entirely sure, but I can definitely check. Uh, hello, Mr. Sean LeBro. Hey, Snatchin. Nice to see you, buddy. And David with the hey, welcome, Snatchin. And Snatchin with the hi, David. Camaraderie. Brotherhood, even. Unlike myself and the Mimic. We are not brothers. We are of the same flesh, and yet I am embarrassed to know him. He is supposed to do 50% of the work, but it feels like I'm doing... 40% and he's doing even less All right, We're going in It's a heck of an attack. I love that arrow, though. Mimic, you gotta stand up and fight. Don't fall. I'll take aggro. No, I said I would take aggro. Don't do it. No! How dare you? You're evil, Loretta. Hi, Loretta. Loretta's mastery. Loretta's war sickle. Very nice. And Loretta and I have the Hallig Tree achievement. Let's go. Happy with that. Um, what would you say has been your highlight standout bosses in Elden Ring? Ooh, so my favorite boss in Elden Ring so far was probably Star Scourge Radon, gotta be honest. Because that is just one of the coolest I have ever seen. It is very cinematic. It was also a fun fight, and it utilized the horse well, like it, it really integrated horse combat in well there, where some of the, the fights on the horse I don't feel as, oh, 208,000? Um, uh, don't defeat too many bosses today, Sean. I'm, I will only be able to play after the 16th again. I'm gonna be honest, Snatch, and I'm pretty sure this is the only boss he's gonna beat today. Sounds good, because following this one is the hardest boss in the entire Souls series, in my opinion. Wow, okay. Um, following this one, huh? Maybe we will go somewhere else. Do we feel ready for the, the boss following this one, then? Uh, Radon W. Pick, thank you, right? That was, a, I think it's a solid fight. And, you know, it's just a cool name, too. Radon is just a cool name. You can't... There's just no way you can't like it, I gotta be honest. Plus, seeing Alexander Warrior Jar flying in there. And all your friends, or allies, at the moment. Woo! But 
But yeah, if, this, if the following boss is too hard, we can come back when we've leveled up a bit, probably. That might, uh, might be beneficial to us. Okay, I'm not gonna take this yet. Let's see if there's anything else. So I'm guessing that goes down then, if we can climb up here. Yeah. So what should we get? Ancient dragon smithing stone again, heck yeah. Let's do that. That is really, really useful. Uh, you should at least attempt it a couple of times. Well, definitely attempt it, absolutely. Okay. Brace. This is a cool area, that's for sure. Holy grease. There's the entrance to another place, major boss in the concert in Snowfield, by the way. Okay, so yeah, we can definitely, you know what? That's where we'll go next if uh, if the boss doesn't, if this boss doesn't pan out. We'll go to the concentrated snowfield and we will go to another place, major boss. Is that through the caves at all, like you're talking about? Or is that, uh, is that something else? Because I'd be interested to, to try it out. That would be a good alternative. Okay. Yeah, this boss took me around four hours to beat for the first time. Okay, got ya. So it's a, it's not an easy boss, that's for sure. And no through a random portal. Okay, well, as long as you can guide me to the portal or point me in the, in the right direction, we'll do that as an alternative. There's a good chance we'll beat this boss first try. Uh, we are number one in the world right now for gravity deaths, so. We're probably number one in the world for beating bosses first try as well, clearly. I was actually trying to jump on that. I need to upgrade my Halberd as well, now that I have the Age of Dragon Smithing Stone, so we'll do that before we fight the boss. Damn, you explore so fast. We, we're moving. We out here moving through. Don't have time to slow down. So the question is, do we want to go down here? I think they can they actually lead together. So actually need an ancient somber dragon smithing stone. Do we really? I, I never even had an ancient dragon smithing stone. So how come it skips the, the standard and goes straight to somber? Why does he gotta be somber immediately? Lightning Great Bull. Uh, I thought that guy had an item on him, like on his body but it was actually just him glowing. Hi, big guy. Hi, guys. You guys drinking in here? Do I have to defeat you two? Oh, Stone Sword Key, I see it. Can I enter it right here? Like, with these guys on me. Woo! Iframes, baby! Triple rings of light, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Woo! That's what I've been waiting for. good with that shield, huh? You know who else uses a shield? A coward. Uh, there's an ancient dragon somber smithing stone near here. I do actually remember there's one relatively close to the alt boss mentioned earlier. And yeah, like he said, I'm sure there's at least one in this area too. Okay, cool. 
cool, cool, cool. So we're set. I mean, no worries, no worries. If we find it, we find it. Uh, it's not a big deal. I just, I thought that the, I didn't realize we needed the somber one. Oh. Is this the, uh, is this what I think it is? Yeah, this is not what I think it is. You think you're so good because you can do that, huh? Doesn't scare me, buddy. Woo! Not afraid of you, big guy. Just don't do it again, okay? Woo! Okay. Hi, big guy. You're cool looking. Somber smithing stone. Jump. Golden rune. So he's probably down right where you're, right there. Is where the uh, dragonstone is on the other side, I'm sure. We'll come back to it. Not afraid of you, big guy. Immediately runs away. Okay. I don't have to be afraid of him to know that I am outmatched. Okay. Doesn't mean I'm afraid of him. I was tactically, I'm not even gonna go the, the tactical retreat thing. It's true, I was tactically evading his monstrous damage attacks. That's all I'm saying. All right, so you know what? Woo! Woo! Grab, grab Newman's rune. Can I get a boom baby? Let's go. Thanks for the tip, guys. Appreciate that. So, what's down here? Is this anything that I've, uh... I haven't been down there yet. There's actually a fog wall down there. Uh, was I done exploring this other area? I know I, I came around. I think there's more over here. I'm just gonna run back here. Let's see what your health looks like. Oh, I actually could. I might be able to tear you up. I know you're the asylum demon. I forget your move set, but David has informed me multiple times that you do share the same move set. I could probably beat this guy for real if we want to, but I think I'm gonna I'm gonna at least explore this area first. I know there's an, I think there was another section over that I, that I missed, and then I have to I want to jump down by the fog wall. I don't know if that's the boss you guys are talking about already. That's difficult, but I'm just gonna run straight here this time and go and grab my runes if I can, and then go that way. And see if there's anything else over there. Uh, yeah, it's down here. Yep, okay. Okay, I see my runes. Let's see if we can go grab them real quick. You don't even have to jump here. Ugh. Hi. You look very friendly. I will continue to just roll like a crazy person until I get to where I need to go. That was some sort of key area. So this is not the boss, but we're going to go here anyway. Iframes real quick. The Chad iframe dodge. Woo! Okay. We in fact perished. What are these things anyway? Uh, and he is now moving away from the stone. I'm not, I got the stone. I know you typed that well before, but I knew what I was doing. What are you talking about? It was well calculated, always. Of course, of course, very tactical. It was tactical. Oh, I guess you're here now. <laughs> not there anymore. Don't worry, we're going to be revisiting that in a second. I wanted to, I, I'm pretty sure there's more over here that I turned around and skipped because I came back for the stone. So hold on. I want to see if there's anything else over here, because I just did that one jump and, and never turned around. And maybe that was the end of it, but I'm not sure. So I want to check over here. If there's nothing else important over here, we can continue on down there. So yeah, this is where it was, and I went out the back. But yeah, see, I can go out this way. That's what I thought. That's some massive damage you got there, my friend. Massive damage. Ooh. 
By the way, the game will not let you roll or attack until you get rid of the stun sword cube. Yeah, I, I actually noticed that. I was genuinely trying to, like, get rid of it after. Because I was pressing it. I'm like, oh, yeah, I can't roll. But uh, it was too late. I had been consumed by health damage. Uh, it's over here. Anything? Hi, my friend. Do so you think I'm supposed to be, like, scared of these ballistas you got? But check this out. I got this better idea for you. Is grab this item. Woo! There we go. I'm not... It's you again, tubby. I'm not afraid of you, buddy. Right, agreed. It should get rid of the message. I absolutely agree. I am trying to panic roll here, and the game is preventing me from doing it. It's pretty rude. Kind of a creep. Putting a, putting a person in a corner that can't get out. His hitbox remains when he's jumping in the air. Fella. His hitbox was still on the ground. I couldn't roll under him. Mm. Oh, I'll tell you. Why? Why did that stop? Stop calling me. Wrecked. Dude, I'll tell you guys. I had it under control. Next spot. Let's go down here. Jump down here. Woo! Jump down here. Woo! Robbed because other than that, you were. I was. I was robbed. I was totally safe. If that wasn't the case. Drop. Tactical drop. Tactical avoid spider thing coming out of the ground. Literal hell spawn. That tactical get puked on. Tactical heal. Tactical run. That she's not here. I have no idea who that character even is, so no, probably not. Pick up the item. America's source seal, nice. Okay. Quest lines are for chomps. Who needs a quest line? All I do is I go around, I collect. I don't fight any of the regular bosses or any of the regular enemies and then I go and I fight a boss and die enough times until I can finally beat it. Classic. Woo. We're going in here now. Beast blood. Ow. Millicent's quest is great. Well, we can probably still do it. I didn't say I wouldn't do it. I'm mainly joking about the quest is for chumps thing. I, uh... I, I'm happy to do them all, actually. I really love this game. I've been loving all the quests and all the content. So if we can still do it, I'll definitely still do it. I'm not, like, actually avoiding it. I just, uh, I literally don't even know who that is. Lord's rune. Just the Lord? Wow, that's a powerful rune. I will say. Hi guys. I just I really want to just run by you real quick. Okay. You know what? That's on me. Okay, that's also on me. I used your blocking technique and it was excellent, thank you. So there's two different ladders we can actually use here. Uh, I died, but it's okay. We got everything at this point. Gives a lot of lore and context to this place and this boss here. Okay. I mean, like I said, I'm still down to do it. David said it should still, probably still be possible. If you would like me to do it, I would be happy to do it. Um, just tell me where I need to go. I will complete my little search of this place. At, and uh, we can go over there and check it out. Depending on what you guys think about it. Yeah, that or the concentrated snow field. We got a lot of options. We're a little over an hour into the stream, or about an hour into the stream. I actually got started a little late today, but we'll go to like 6.15 today. 
So we have a little over an hour. So I can finish up. I don't have too much more here I want to do. I want to go check out the right section after we get out of this room here. And I want to... Uh, I think I ran the whole way here, actually. So maybe I don't even need to do this. Let me check something out real quick. Are these ladders bound to... Is there a ladder there? There is, isn't there? Yes, this is the ladder. So actually, I don't even need to do what I wanted to do. I do want to climb up here and see if there's anything on that side. But also intertwines with some other quests as well. Probably check your inventory key items for a needle just to see if you've even started the quest. Okay. Is it a key? Okay, key item for a needle. I will, I will look. I'm almost done exploring this area for now. Just my basic run through, so I'll do it after that. Shouldn't be too long. I might be able to finish it this run, depending on if we can survive a few extra minutes here. I just want to run up this side and see what we got. Hallig Tree Soldier Ashes. It's a fun one. Ashes are always fun. Broken Needle. Okay. Broken Needle sounds familiar, actually. I think I do have that. Can I grab this from you guys? Would you mind? I know you got, like, your ballistas here and all, but thank you. Uh, is there anything? Oh. I didn't really want all that to happen. Anyway, that's actually everywhere I wanted to go over there. There's one more place I want to explore in this little area. But we can actually do it after. I'll look for the needle now. And let's see where we're at. So key items. So for key items, I have... Uh, I don't know what it would look like. Like, does it actually look like a needle? Gold sewing needle, maybe? It's not a broken needle, though. Sewing needle, gold sewing needle. No broken needle. No broken needle. Uh, Grace, just be on that tree, dude, too. Okay, okay, we can definitely go get that Grace, then, and just finish up this little section. Not a sewing needle. Okay, we don't have it. So see, it makes sense why I don't know where that who that character is. All is good and all is well in the world, really. Let's go get this Grace. We can, we'll KO this tree, dude. Actually, I should go up there. Ooh. Wait, those are the guys throwing up on me? Is that what I just saw? I thought it was like that putrid spider looking thing. Okay. We will get the needle. All will be well in the world. Hi, tree dude. Cool. Thank you for the tip, David. I mean, that's fine. You can do that. I've already, uh, I've already gotten the grace, fella. You're a little late. You cannot stop me. Let's get these runes. Let's get this item. All right. Now that we got this, if you would like, I can go back and we can go and get the needle. Go to Khaled, find Sage Gallery. Okay. You know, going to Khaled, going back to Khaled, and going to Florida. Yeah. <laughs> Do we have a closer uh, destination? <laughs> Khaled's pretty big. Um, let's see here. Uh... No, I, I don't think I did meet him. I don't I don't know who a lot of these people are. Streets of Sages Ruins. If you have the Celia Grace, okay. Let's take a look at the Celia Grace. It'd be near the swamp. Uh okay. I don't Oh, this is the swamp here. So no. East of the big swamp. Okay, this is I'm assuming this is the swamp, right? It looks swampy, and it's called Swamp Shore. 
So east of that is this way. Oh, here's Celia. Celia Understair. Celia Crystal Tunnel. We do have the, the Crystal Tunnel. Okay, on this path. If we haven't done it, I can just go here and follow it along. Is the tunnel important? Here's the Everjail. Go Understair. Okay. Thanks, guys. You guys are awesome because me, it would take me forever. All right. Oh, right. Okay, I actually do know where we're at here. Um... Oh, and head south. Okay. South. Okay. I guess it doesn't matter. Do you want me to stay in this town here and head south like this? Go through the city. Okay. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. Do, 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 do. Stop by the shack. Okay. I will stop by the shack. Oh, left, just past it, you said. Okay. I just passed it. Is this the shack here? This little guy? Ooh. Oh, a pleasure to Gary. see you. A pleasure indeed. I am Gary. A Wait, hold your hands sage. like that. In my day, anyway. I'd hoped to ask a favor when one of your ilk came along. A strapping young torch to lead across the scarlet swamp of Aeonia. I can do that. Don't find. I'll provide fine recompense. Can you stop slipping through the wall? I'll teach you the secret of Celia, the time you see there. Cool. Careful on the dog kill him. Okay. Come here, buddy. Don't destroy the house and make the house cave in on him. I don't even know if he can really get out. Here he is. Can you, can you come out here? There we go. Thanks, guys, for guiding me here, by the way. I, re I really do appreciate it. I know I joke around a lot about not caring about the lore and stuff, but really it's just because I'm just playing and having fun, and I'm not thinking about these specific things. So I appreciate you guys bringing me here. Oh, a pleasure to see. I, I'd hope to okay, I think it actually canceled this, so let's go through this again. Will we will accept. Yes. I need your help to heal a certain young girl. Okay. Her name is Millicent. Millicent. You will find her beyond Celia, resting at the church atop the cliff. Atop the cliff. Stricken by the rotting sickness. The rotting sickness that afflicts Millicent has no cure. When the Erd tree flourished, even the demigods could not stave off its effects, despite their nigh godhood. But Millicent's suffering can be ameliorated. For this, Good word. you are to find a certain needle. Seek the deep scarlet swamp of Aeonia outside Celia's bounds. The needle, made from unalloyed gold, is lost somewhere there. Okay. First, you must find the unalloyed gold needle. It's hidden somewhere in the deep scarlet swamp of Aeonia. Then I will tell you, as promised, the secret of the town of Celia. Okay, cool. I think he's good. First, it's yep. Okay, it's all the dialogue. Uh, next, look for a boss in the middle of the swamp. All right, you got it. Uh, I'll go to the inner Aeonia. And we will... Let's turn that off. There we go. And we will turn around. Uh, which way were we? So we're facing this way, right? So if we turn around... For a boss in the middle of the swamp. All right. Um. Okay. I 
can't ride my horse there. Made by Millicent. Excellent. Is this poison rot? Yeah, I I was literally Millicent has died. Millicent, she's come to get you. Uh, never mind. <laughs> uh, even the demigods could not stave off its effects. Hmm, curious. And yet this little bulk called Bolas I found seems to cure it perfectly. Yeah, that is a little suspicious. That's why I was like, is this poison rot? Okay, so... Sure, we're over-leveled, so we tore that up. Is that, the, is that the boss, though? I mean, I know she's related to the quest, of course, but is that who, who we were actually coming to for the... Is that the reason we were coming to the, the middle of the swamp, I guess is what I'm asking? Or is there something else I'm looking for? Also, I just realized uh, maybe there was a sight of grace or something here. I probably could have grabbed something and spun closer to the sage again. Boss is under a big... Oh, that's, that's not the boss. Okay. Boss under a big tree stump. I'll keep looking. That's perfectly fine. I wasn't sure if that was the boss or not. I didn't want to look around and waste time if it wasn't. You spawn near it. Okay. Clear lore explanation is that there's a god out there, someone who really, really likes things that are shaped like balls, and has given them mysterious and impressive powers. Really? Commander O'Neill. So is, is this Neil? But he's O'Neill. He's got a helmet on, so maybe it's not the same, actually. Or, the other one did have a helmet on, but his face was exposed. Hey, I, I don't care about you. But you have to understand, guys. I'm just trying to summon my Mimic here. Enough. Love beaten bosses that were over level four. Get destroyed. Get flexed on. That was clear skill. Okay, here's the unalloyed gold needle. Isn't it unalloyed? But I guess unalloyed sounds better. Next, give Gary the needle. That makes sense. Okay. So we'll go back here. I'll just do it from here again since I know how to get there. Cool. It's the same thing. Okay. Oh, we can upgrade the halberd too when we get time. So I know that weapon gives a pretty good buff, so it unironically might be worth upgrading and sticking in your left hand so your medical occasionally equip it and cast a buff for you. Really? Okay. I appreciate that. Yeah, we can do that. We can absolutely do that. After you give it to him, you need to reload the area. Fast way to do that is quit and reload. You found the unalloyed gold needle. As promised, <laughs> I've detailed the secret of Celia right here. Go on. It's yours. Celia's secret. Now let me have a look at the needle. Hmm. <laughs> He's pondering that needle. Well, this is a marvel indeed. The work of a true artisan. A meticulous, bold craftsman who grasps the essence of life. Can you give me some time with this? As well made as it is, it won't be much use snapped in half, will it? That's a good point. 
Okay. Can you give me a swell mate? Okay, cool. Uh, welcome in. How you doing? Appreciate you joining the stream. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna back out and we're gonna load it up again. Hey, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. What's up? Um, okay, I like that he says, give us some time, by the way, and like just quitting out and rejoining. It's like, yeah, enough time has passed. I have awaited your return. The needle is repaired. Now it will forestall the rotting sickness, I'm sure. Will you give it to the girl, Millicent? I will reward you in kind. Okay. So we have the Minnesota new version of this. The church atop the cliff beyond Celia, the town yonder. Tended to by the witless pests who worship her, or rather her rotting sickness, as a god. A wretched fate, indeed. The poor girl, she never wished for any of this. So when I'm playing Elden Ring, I'm trying to summon my friend. He said he put his summon down and used the thing, but doesn't show his summon sign on the floor. Ever since I defeated the boss at behind the castle location. Um, honestly, I'm a bit of a scrub. I appreciate you coming in, and I'd be happy to help you if I could. I think David could probably help you, and and Super Crim could probably help you. They're both very skilled. Uh, Soul Scan generally don't let you summon areas you've already completed, unfortunately. That might be the issue, actually. I like, yeah, I have awaited your return. Yeah, I mean, I've been standing in the corner for a good 20 hours or however long it's been. Do you find it peculiar that I would show such concern for the girl? Well, I'm the one that found her. I mean, not necessarily. I didn't think you were like a creep or anything. But now you're making me, one of my dear you're making me uh, go back on that thought. The sickness erodes one's memory. I doubt that she remembers the first thing about me. Oh, I must be getting old. I didn't always worry so much. <laughs> okay. Now, all you need to do is deliver the needle to Millicent. She's convalescing in the church atop the cliff just beyond Celia. Do so, and you shall receive a handsome recompense, of course. Now she's okay, cool. Do so. so, um, thank you guys for helping. That, that was really nice of you. Um, hopefully you can summon your friend. It, it kind of, it's kind of weird that they won't let you summon it at all times. They should. That would be better, honestly. But uh, okay, so now we have to go give it to her. Uh, to Millicent, which apparently she's at the, the church, is what I've heard. So the church. I'm not talking about the bestial sanctum. All right. I don't see an actual church anywhere in Khaled right now. We haven't discovered it. Okay, that makes more sense then. From stuff that kind of needs to work on how it does multiplayer. Yeah, it's kind of silly because, like, if they're going to let you do it, I kind of feel like, uh, yeah, I kind of feel like they should, they should just let you do it. Not all these rules. Okay, northeast of the Celia town. Gotcha. Thank you for the tip. So we need to go, oh, wait, northeast? Wait. Yeah, north is here. How... Oh, we, we did go south. I'm sorry. I was like, how did we get here? No, we, we did go south after traveling here. That makes a lot of sense. Okay. I was thinking we went north for some reason uh, coming from here. So, all right. Northeast from the town. So, northeast. Stick to a general area of around here. There's a mod on PC called Seamless Call. That is actually really good for playing with friends if you're on PC. Dark Souls 2 had a mechanic that let you summon people after the boss was killed. Yeah, see? I don't see what the problem would be then. this by the way nothing we can access yet okay 
I'm guessing, honestly, I'm thinking probably more than this, right? Like, probably over here. Maybe this is the church, or maybe I should go up there. I don't know. Oh, you need to light all the fires in the town. Oh, for that? Oh, so this is like the other ever jail that we did? Got ya. Okay, we don't have to do all that right now, but... Oh, we do have to do it to open up the path? Okay. Um... See if I can find them then. It's a cool area back here. Red main painting. Okay. Uh, yes, they are all on roofs. You got it. I will go up there so weird some of these things okay I was not trying to fall off there. Evening. Hey, what's up, Blackbird? How you doing, buddy? Very nice to see you, my friend. Thanks for stopping in. So... Wow. Evening to you as well. David, so formal. I imagine David is like tipping the hat. Evening to you, good sir. So we're back in Florida, as you can see, Blackbird. Right now we're trying to light some, light some lights. Classic light lighting. You wanna know something crazy? What's crazy? Uh, okay. Come on, just let me up there. I think I could actually do it, but. Why is my life so sad? So now I can get up here. I'm just curious if there's anything along here. There's not. I discovered your content because you did a stream on Tuhu. Yeah. 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 Saku. Way back. It's just a coincidence, a coincidence that I'm also a huge fan of. Uh, sorry. A huge FromSoft fan. Heck yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 I'm glad. You know, I appreciate that. Um, thank you for letting me know that. A and B. Yeah. That stream was really fun. I actually. I'm new to a lot of the, the it's actually would be pronounced Toho, I think uh, would be the, the correct pronunciation or, or the closest in English. The, uh, the Toho games are a lot of fun. A lot of fun. I, I'm really new to them. I played, I played a few of them before without realizing what they were a part of or without knowing any of them. Uh, one of them being, I believe, what, what is it called? Lunar Nights? Is that what it is? And that was years and years ago. I mean, I don't know. I would say at least four years ago. I, I don't know when it came out. So, but it, it was a really long time ago. I played on Xbox, and then going forward from there, uh, I have a friend in the Discord community who is making a Toho-inspired fighter, and so they asked me to watch some of these clips, play some of these games. I was doing that. And that was really fun, and I found that there was uh, Saku. 
So I'd be able to give lots of insight there if you were to play more. Yeah, I mean, I'm interested in playing more. I actually genuinely was enjoying everything that I did. Everything I played from it. I got to watch some of the content. I think it's just, I think it's all fan-made content. Like, I'm not exactly sure what the base, or, or let's say, original content was, where it initially came from. But I've seen a lot more and more of it, and I'm like, man, this is really good. And uh, I, I was actually genuinely enjoying a lot of it. So yeah, we did that stream. I have, uh, I, I'm playing some more of the fighting game that that member of the community is is involved in. And I was looking it up. I was trying to type it in the other day because we did a dev stream on that game. And there are so many, so many games and so many stream categories for that that content. Sorry guys, I'm not trying to be like a loser, but um, I don't, I can't tell for the life of me where another one's at. So I got this one here. Okay. I don't even see one. I'm guessing it's that big tall tower, but I did not even like how. Is there a way up in this one? Okay. Don't think there's a way up to this one, which would m mean that guy right there. Okay, I see that one. I see there's a ladder up there. Okay, they're all in towers like the first one. So I noticed that... Um, really? See, yeah, I, I'm really, I don't have that sort of knowledge at all. In fact, I'm very new to it. So that's pretty interesting. You were definitely very knowledgeable about it. That could absolutely assist me uh, learning a lot more of that. That way I knew what I was watching and playing and I could work more with it and communicate better with uh, people who are interested in it too. I was trying to not fall there. Uh, so the first step, get on pretty much any roof and travel. Okay, thank you. Uh, you know, you know what? Super Crim did tell me that they were all on the roofs. I just didn't realize that the ta they were all on the towers. So I was kind of just looking. Um, I just joined the Discord. I could send it there. Yeah, absolutely. You just joined? Gotcha. Perfect. I'll set you up. Yeah, I see your background is perfect. Here, I will... Thank you so much, so much for for joining and for everything, really. Um, whoops. I always do a welcome message. I know you're here, but you still deserve it. Uh, last, uh, oh yes, yes, we did get it now. Thank you, but you know what? Your tip did help me because I didn't realize they were on the towers. I didn't like. I knew I was looking on the roofs. So I didn't realize I could just skip everything if it wasn't a tower really so i was kind of just being silly but now i learned if there's any more like this i know for next time skyrim climbing classic skyrim climbing Thanks. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you. Thank you for everything. All right, so we got about 45 minutes, a little bit under. But we're doing really well today, I think. Another successful episode. Sacred Tear. It was just a winding pass, but I guess that works too. We're doing that Skyrim climb. Classic. Pog Skyrim climbing, right? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. So I realize that I actually have this real quick. Good old sacred tear. Okay, let's go talk to her then. I don't see anything else around. Who's there? Well, 
It matters not. If you are wise, you will leave immediately. My flesh writhes with scarlet rot. It is a curse. Not to be meddled with by man. So I'm assuming we're giving the gold needle. Uh, just because you guys are helping me with the quest, I'm going to make sure before I do it. Don't want to accidentally screw it up. But if this is me, even if I didn't know what the quest was, I would give her the needle anyway. So. Oh. Quick stretch real quick. Okay, just a warning, the Zuhu paper is over a year, so the newest games I mentioned are no longer the newest now. That's fine, that's still really, uh, that would be really helpful, I'm not even kidding, because that's actually something I'm trying to learn more of. So, uh, I still appreciate it, and, and I'll take that in consideration that it's a year old. Yet again, pretty sure a bolus would have worked just saying. I agree, I honestly. That I stab myself with the needle to quell the scarlet rot, but how? Never mind. I've decided I would rather trust you than simply continue to spoil from within. Would you mind averting your eyes for a moment? Um. <sighs> show and tell, that's a good one. That was easier than expected. We can do show and tell. I got some stuff I can use this time. But why do I feel so... Let's finish talking to her real quick. Oh, she fell asleep right away and knocked her out. She's got a, a little barrier around her. All right, so show and tell. All right, guys. I got a good show and tell this time. You ready? You guys watch Breaking Bad by chance? It's no spoilers. If you know Breaking Bad, you should know this. Uh, the look might be a little unfamiliar if you haven't watched it the whole way through. But classic Breaking Bad. I have a Breaking Bad Funko Pop here of Jesse holding some of that blue sky. And, yeah, this is a custom-made one that I got. And I, I really love this one. I'm really happy with this. So, I think it's really cool. Breaking Bad is one of my favorite shows, actually. I really love it. Um... I love custom figures, custom pops, custom whatever, really. I try and get everything custom. So I was really excited when I saw someone working on uh, characters from Breaking Bad. They do have official ones, but the official ones were also more expensive anyway. And I was like, okay, I'll just do the custom one, which is more unique. All right, so next, reload with resting. So, oh, reload with resting? Like, just rest and come back out? Or... Oh, I don't even have to quit this time. I hoped to see you. I, I haven't left. My apologies for when last we met. Thanks, David. I fainted before I could even thank you. Everything is as you said. Since inserting the needle, the scarlet rot has ceased to writhe. Even the nightmares have abated. And now, though I can scarcely believe it myself, I can move as I please. Not that I could ever truly repay you, but I would like you to have this by way of thanks. A token though it is. Okay. I'm considering leaving. I hope to see you again. Yeah, I haven't left. Buried in my flesh. I've started to recall. Oh. But dimly, my destiny. It's all thanks to you. My name is Millicent. I pray fate permits us meet again. Thanks, that makes sense, David. I was like, I'm how's... I'm considering me with the needle buried in my flesh. My destiny. Okay. I'm considering with the needle my destiny. All right, all right, all right. So we are good here. So now go back to Gallery Shack. Uh... Can I go up from here? I don't know if I can or not, like for real. But you know, I'll go here again since we know it. It's gonna be a closer one though. 
This is going to be so far away. It's not even that far, but I'm like, dang it, I don't want to go that far. All right. No, you can't make it up from the swamp. <laughs> Dang. Oh. Oh. Hello again. Something about this place felt familiar to me. So I decided to pay a visit. Hoping to find someone here. But I've only found... <laughs> Seriously. Perhaps before my departure, I needed someone to say farewell to. Okay. Well... You can say farewell to me. I'm right here. I must You're saying I'm not someone. Journey. For which I have you to thank. I must stay strong. Well, never mind. I must. I must. Okay. Uh, how did she get here quicker than you, speedrunner? Yeah, seriously, she got there really quickly. Reload the game again. Okay, so uh, let's reload the game. Continue. Okay, creepy. Thank you kindly for giving the needle to Millicent. Yeah, well, where'd she go? Where? How'd you get here? She too can begin Creep. her journey and stare her fate straight in the eye. You've been a saint through and through. As thanks. I vow to impart to you my knowledge. Better be good. Of the lost sorceries of the Senians, descendants of the Eternal. Okay, so we could do study sorcery, which, you know, I'm not much of a sorcerer, but that is cool. Oh, you noticed, did you? Indeed, Millicent did visit this hall of a home. It seems the memories eaten away by the rotting sickness yet remain, but faintly. However, she has no need of me anymore. No, she must embark on her journey and stare her fate in the eye. I mustn't impede. As I've aged, I've found the best way to aid the young is to be forgotten. Kind of sad. Please make certain that little Millicent goes unharmed. Creep. Like her mother, she has the stuff to be a great warrior but commands only one arm and is yet preciously young. Do you need me for something else? I'm just talking. Do you? I'm just making sure you got nothing else. Next to go to the uh, next go to the Erdtree Gazing Hill in Altus. All right. Erdtree Gazing Hill. Take me a second to find that. Or tree gazing hill. Here we go. <laughs> All righty. Bottom left of Altus. Perfect. 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 No, 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 that was good. You're right. Bottom left, middle left, same thing. Find her on that hill. Okay. And that we can. Ah, we meet again. In truth, it's been smooth sailing for me. The scarlet rot has stilled since last we met. As such, I've been able to continue my journey, though rather vexingly. I realized that if I still had my sword arm, I could have aided you in battle. Okay. I'm 
assuming we give her this. Again, going to just wait for confirmation, since you guys are being kind. You already have the next item you need to give to her. Okay, perfect. Giving me this arm. Thank you. I am in your debt yet again. I think. If the arm serves well enough, it might be possible for me to wield a sword again. Hmm. If the arm... It might be perhaps then I can aid you in battle. If the... It might be possible perhaps then... Alright, are we going to hit it with a reload or are we going to go somewhere else? Go to Windmill Village. Okay. Is that also in... Here? Windmill Village. Okay. Windmill Village it is. Creeps. Everybody's laughing like that. You're a creep. Where you fought the Godskin Apostle. This is where I fought the Godskin Apostle. Really? Let me put the one in the. Oh, well, whatever. Uh, I don't remember, honestly. Uh, not joking. But. I'll look. I'll see if we can figure it out. Right here. This was a godskin apostle here? Ah. We meet yet again. The arm you gave me truly is a thing of wonder. It feels just like my own. Even handling a sword. Perhaps it is foolish to say this to you of all people, but I am sure of my skill with the sword. <laughs> Thus, I would have you call upon me in battle, should you ever have the need. I would have you call It is the only way that I can express my thanks. Okay. I would have you call It is the only... Okay, so... Done. Spoke to her, now she's got... Okay, next. Ancient Snow Valley Ruins. Ancient Snow Valley Ruins. Is that in... Uh, I know. I was. I swear to God, I was thinking the same thing, David. I'm like, they just don't care that I'm wearing all this. Yeah, I, I look ridiculous. Okay, it's in the giant mountaintops. That's actually where I was going to look, but I wasn't sure. Ancient Snow Valley Ruins right here. All right, we got about 25 minutes left. We'll go to 6.15 today because I did start late. So here we are. I'm assuming I have to find her here as well. Thank you for guiding me through this, guys, yet again. I really appreciate it. Um, next to the grace, really? We need a blind emote. Wow. Wow. Sean the blind. You know what? You're absolutely right. You're absolutely right. We need, I mean, oh God, hold on. Do I have this one in here? I don't think I can show, I don't think I can like use this for that, can I? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> if I, I need to put it over both eyes halfway, Did yeah. think we'd meet in such a place? What could your purpose possibly? No. I know well enough who you are. And what I know is good enough for me. Call upon me again. In battle. Should you have the need. Yeah, you already said that, though. I'm searching for a fort to the north of the ruins. North of the I ruins. the master of the fort was given a medallion that allowed him to visit the That is the correct. Tree. That is correct. Indeed. I believe that is where Melania will be found. Melania. The Halic tree is hidden somewhere in these northern lands. I can tell you, I'm I've been there. For a fort. I heard. The... 
Okay. So finally, prayer room back in Hallowed Tree and you'll be all caught up. Thank you. See, we did awesome. Thanks. Thanks a lot for guiding me through that, guys. We made pretty good time with it, too. Again we meet. I can only surmise our purposes are aligned. In which case, allow me to explain myself. I am of Melania's blood. Okay. But in what capacity, I know not. I could be a sister, daughter, or an offshoot. Whatever the case, though, I am certain of a kinship between us. Call upon me for a battle, but you've already fought all the battles she could have helped. There is something <laughs> I must return to Melania. Okay. The will that was once her own. The dignity. The sense of self that allowed her to resist the call of the Scarlet Rot. Oh, she had Scarlet Rot. Okay. she abandoned to meet Radon's measure. There is something I must return. The will that was once her own. Oh. The dignity. There is some of the will, the dignity. Okay. For some extra optional details, go talk to Gallery. Yeah, why not? Let's do it. Might as well. And buy the pest threads. We might as well. We've already come this far. We might as well do that too. And then once we do this, I suppose it is time to proceed with the boss, or at least move closer. I don't know if the boss is right there. We got it the other grace, but I haven't actually explored any farther. Melania is the flower lady in the opening cutscene that was fighting Radon, and it's why he was in the same the battlefield where you fought him. Really? Is that true? Ah, welcome, welcome. How may I help? Uh, okay. So, you gave Millicent a golden arm replacement. This is a wonderful development. Thank you for your kindness. Now, Millicent may fully realize That's her awesome. true warrior's potential. Like her beautiful mother. Right, so she's the daughter to Melania. The girl right, Melania. Is that her name? She is a bird. Green and undeveloped waiting to flower into magnificence what a wondrous day that will be in truth before her i would never seen a bud of such superior quality she might very well outshine her sisters oh millicent finding herself is she the words of a true innocent the dear girl well perhaps this is just as it should be Little Millicent following in the steps of her mother, no matter what. This is their fate, after all. You wanted me to buy what? Threads? The pest threads. Screw it, why not? Do you have an interest in rot incantations? Then you might like to learn something of the history of Melania. Melania. Goddess that's of Scarlet Rot. First character we saw, one of the few characters in the announcement trailer. Queen okay. America and her king consort Radigan were blessed with twin demigods, and Melania was one of them. She was born an Empyrean carrying the Scarlet Rod. An Empyrean is no mere demigod. In the age of the Elden Ring and Queen Manica, the precious Empyrean was born, a new god. To forge a new order since Melania fought Red okay Dawn, there it is and the great scarlet flower blossomed in Aeonia I have dedicated myself to her and to the resplendence resplendence of the order wow of rot, the cycle of decay and rebirth cool desperate prayer do you cool Thanks, guys, for real, for guiding me through that. That is awesome. Now we have learned a bit. So let's go back to here. We got about 15 minutes. 
Oh yeah, that fight is also the reason Khaled looks like Florida. Yeah, I mean, Khaled does look like Florida. That's one hell of a fight, I'll tell you that. We're gonna go here now, and we are gonna try and see if we can get this boss. You think you can chill out for a second, bro? I just wonder what was in the chest. Yeah, we definitely need to upgrade our weapon, you're totally right. Let's see if I can go get my runes real quick. Uh, yo, man, hey, what's up? How you doing, Sidewalk Chalk? Thanks for stopping in. I appreciate it. Runes. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna grab this item. Item. Rotten Crystal Sword. Nice. Never been able to open that chest without killing all three of them. I will skip every enemy in this game, including the next boss. Not really, but. Uh, let's see if there's another. I don't know if there's another Sight of Grace, so. Do we want to upgrade the weapon now, or is there another Sight of Grace before? Oh, this is a pretty big area. There's probably going to be another one. Lack of pants provides the superhuman speed need to get past them, I think. And that's really what it is. You don't, you can't have pants wearing you down. Really, in any aspect of life. Two more sites of race. Okay. Thank you. All right, you know what? You can kill me. I got my item. I am satisfied. All right, we got about 15 minutes. Like I said, we'll stay on a little bit later today because I started a little bit late. That one's on me. I think that's only fair. But before we wrap up, since we got, since we're coming close to the end of the stream, I want to say thank you again, guys, for all the help you've given me today. And also, I want to say, um, I want to say thank you to everyone who's been watching these videos on YouTube. You guys have been really kind, and you've also been giving me tips and suggestions, and I really appreciate it. Thanks for, for checking them out and, and joining me on this journey. Whether it's live or after the fact, I really appreciate it, guys. This is a really fun journey to go on, and it's better with you guys being here for sure, so thanks a lot. Uh, rip weapon upgrading. Not yet. We are not going to rip weapon upgrading. We will get through this. Quick Step Ash of War is the way to go. Oh, to get through this junk. To get through all this junk right here. Oh, slow. Look how slow we are. There's probably an item back there. Is it really not? Ooh. Ooh. I know that one. Rusted Iron Ring. Good old Dark Souls 1. Classic Dark Souls 1. Oh gosh, why is this like this? Okay. Ugh. Enough. Enough. The waterfall of rot. Rip to anybody who missed that jump after running through that. I know I could use the bolus and get rid of this. I really, really was hoping to just uh, get to the site of grace. I wonder if we should go down that ladder. Is there anything up here real quick? No way, is there actually nothing there? Crap, okay. I've got one more heal. I'm gonna pop it. I'm gonna slide down this ladder and hopefully there's a sight of grace. Cause I'm not using a bolus. We use no boluses here, ladies and gents. I will not perish to Scarlet Rot today. Yes, yes, ladies and gentlemen, let's go. All right. Uh, at least it's not as bad as 5-2 in Demon's Souls. I, I know that one. We, I, 
100% of Demon Souls and Dark Souls 1 so far, so I'm very familiar with these references. Uh, Demon Souls 5 too, yeah, that one's a that one's an annoying one. Gotti, I always save World 5 for last in Demon's Souls. Almost there. Alright, um, I'm gonna be really annoying, and I'm actually going to go to the round table and upgrade my weapon now. Um, sorry guys, I'm being really stupid right now. What is the freaking thing? I can't remember. I can't remember what the, the shortcut was. Is it Y? Okay, whatever. Uh, oh, really? Was it only like a 30 second run? Okay, well, we are here already. We'll do this. We'll, we'll get this done real quick and then we'll go back. I still got like 12 minutes. We can upgrade this and make it to the last side of grace and probably do one Back boss around. attempt. So, oh, let's see. I'll upset the girl. Why then X? She says okay, that thank you. Are broken, I'm free. And if I stay here, I will be ruined with the round table. <laughs> what use have I for freedom now? I smith weapons to slay a god. I have lived and will die doing so upon this spot. Thanks, guys. Is there any other way? Okay. So strength and armament. Boom. And it is max level. There's an achievement, too. God slaying armament. Wonderful. Uh, we could upgrade that torch real nice. Uh, I know, David, you said that other weapon. I haven't forgotten about that. We will upgrade the other weapon and per perhaps give it to the, uh, the, um, Mimic. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten. Just gonna keep going right now, because we're almost at the end here. Which one was I at? I know I, I passed the Interwall Drainage Channel. That would make sense. Okay, let's trigger this thing. Okay. <laughs> Maybe a minute or two. Okay. No worries. We will get there. We will get there. We still got 10 minutes. I don't think there's anything else up there. So I could probably jump to the rooftop safely. Let's go up here first, because I don't I don't know if I can get back up here necessarily. Oh, there's a lot of stuff I can do. Okay. Let's uh Can I make it to this one? This one looks a little sketchy. Okay, I can. We just ended up here again? Oh no, this is a... We are higher up. But this is... Okay, this is where we were at. Does this really do anything for us? Thanks. That was a pretty cool jump. Did it do anything though? Like, is this actually useful at all? Maybe they hid something out here? It's not looking like it. All right, I think that was actually pointless. I mean, it was cool, don't get me wrong. That was actually the way back up. Oh, okay. So I just went a little too far. So if I jump back here. This one. Yeah, I saw like that, but I'm surprised there wasn't anything. So I can fall in there. Is there anything on this roof before we go in? I was like trying to be really, trying to explore, see all my options, but it doesn't even feel like any of them are super. Woo. Anything up here? Dragon. 
Dragon Crest, Great Shield Talisman. Nice. Uh, okay, cool. So there's that. Should be, yep, this right here. Assembly. Uh, butterfly. I'm guessing it's inside here. Didn't know there was a way back up. Yeah, I didn't either. That was cool. I'm guessing it's that path inside, but I just want to see. We got seven minutes, so we can definitely go through here and see what else we got. Uh, anything else before we proceed farther? I'm not going to explore down there right now. Or maybe I will. It's kind of calling to me. Let's go in here and let's see, let's see if we can get our Sight of Grace first. I didn't realize there was going to be this much out here. I, I just wanted to check it out, but it's actually like a whole area out here. So there's a few paths here even. Uh, Talisman's really good for phys physical defense. Okay. Isn't that a shield though? And boss is further inside. Okay. So we got this right here. Which I'll heal. Traveler's clothes. You made it. Thank you. Appreciate the support. We did it. It's not a shield. It's like a ring. It was? Enormously boosts physical damage. Negation. All right, let's do it. What was this, by the way, that we got? Greatly raises maximum HP, vastly raises maximum stamina. Raises stamina recovery speed. Greatly greatly raises maximum HP, but we have a plus. Oh, no, no, that's the one we have on. I'm sorry. I wonder if we should put on the other one. Um, okay. Let's just see what's up here real quick. Is this... Uh... Is that just back up? Should I use that? <laughs> I wanna, wanna make bets. Will he die in the first 10 seconds? <laughs> oh, definite. Really? Is it gonna be that quick? I feel like it could last 10 seconds. But we'll find out, I mean. Okay, it's 15. See, 15. I can, I can bet on that. So I'm losing these runes by 11,000 then. Okay, I don't think there's anything else. I think the time has come. So I'm not... All right, you know what? Let's just do it. We got five minutes, so we'll give it one or two attempts. Let's go. Okay. Hype. I dreamt for so long. You just waking up now? My flesh was dull gold, and my blood rotted. Corpse after corpse left in my wake. As I awaited his return. Heed my words. I am Melania, 
blade of Mikola. And I have never known defeat. So I've heard from the chat. All right, so. Whoa! Why don't you back up a second? Scared the crap out of me. I like actually jumped off that. Doing a little, da oh, quite a bit of damage with that attack. Yeah, get her, mimic. You will know defeat. You will when the mimic and I double team your dumbass. Leave the mimic alone. My heart is beating so fast. <laughs> nice combination. I'm literally trembling. I'm like, actually scared. <laughs> okay. No. I don't, I don't, I don't, no! Dang it. Dang it. Dang it, dang it. That was so good. That felt so good. Okay. Uh, should have actually started a gamble. Dodge your initial burst. Impressive reaction there. He's going to die to waterfowl. <laughs> Targeted mimic. Pog first attempt already. Honestly insane. Waterfowl. Oh, that was a good attack that she did. Oh, I was like actually like everything tensed up. It was scary. It was hyped up so much. It was, it was, it was really fun though. I gotta give it one more attempt. I know it's 6.15. I gotta go one more. That was awesome. Is she gonna do that? That actually scared, like, I'm not kidding. I'm gonna watch it again on stream. That actually scared me the first time. I was literally so scared. I was just trying to like panic roll. As she freaked me out a little bit there. Is that waterfowl? Is that what it's called? Really impressive attack. So is she, she's healing, I didn't realize. She's healing, is she healing as she does damage?
I know she's gonna get up. I mean, you two in sync, right? The mimic and I. I, I know she's gonna get. If you guys were saying it was so difficult, I knew it wasn't over like that. But I still. Uh, hasn't noticed the bloodborne healing yet. Oh yeah, there's the bloodborne healing. Life steals. Pog second phase. Actually hit second phase, second try. The mimic was the mimic and I were in tandem. Wait. That's really cool. Oh, that's a cool, that's a really cool form. <laughs> I don't, I don't want to. My, my heart is actually pounding. I was actually very nervous. Okay. Whoopsie. Uh, can I run into that? Nope. Okay. Oh, that's not good. Ooh. Ooh. That, that is not looking good on that one. You know what? Yeah, that was really cool. That was really cool looking. All right, you know what? I honestly, I did not know, like, no spoilers, but I knew the, the way you guys were talking about this would be a second phase boss. So I'm I'm proud that we got there. I'm glad we got there. Uh, that's the hardest dodge skill in the game, really. Okay. So yeah, we're gonna have we're gonna have a tough fight ahead of us there, but cool. All right, at least I know what I'm in for now. So thanks for sticking with me, guys, and for helping me figure out the lore and get here. This was really fun. I'm glad we did this. I'm really excited for next time. My heart was actually pounding. I'm not kidding. Like I actually was. Uh, I was. I. I. I was feeling like anxiety fighting that. <laughs> I guess is is what I could say. Uh, I, I. I could feel everything in my body working as I was fighting that, and that was just the first phase. So I just really wanted to do well, knowing that, because you know there are a lot of tough bosses in these games. So, hearing all that is pretty cool. Took me like an hour or two to hit second phase. Hitting it second try is insane. Thank you. I really appreciate that. I, it was probably, honestly, uh, a little bit of dumb luck because I was just in tandem with the with the uh, Mimic. But I am still, I feel proud of that. So thank you for the support there. Whew. Uh, it's okay. I'm going to try and learn it a little bit. Uh, I, try, I really do try and stay. I don't mind like like uh cheese in it and stuff but i feel like i should probably try and learn this one uh next time because you guys are saying how difficult it is i want to see if i can really beat it but i'm really really excited to do this next time so yeah that's all i got today guys i'm gonna head out but next wednesday we'll be back and let's try and let's try and tear this up yeah i'll uh I'll see if I can learn it because this this is remind me of like a Sekiro boss, and so I really want to I want to see if I can do it. This is going to be one where it's going to feel like really good to beat. I feel like, uh, cool. Thanks guys for everything, and I'll catch you next week. Hopefully, if you're around, thank you so much, David, Super Crim, uh, everyone. Thank you so much for being here, and like I said, everyone in the YouTube comments that's been helping me out. Thank you guys very much. That is awesome of you. Everyone have a good night, and I'll catch up with you next week. Thank you so much. Bye, guys.